What's going on, everybody? It's your girl, Miss Kaysen. And as you can see, new do alert. So, uh, I don't know what to say about this. I saw this in the store, and it wasn't what I was going in for in the first place. And um, something about the color. I was like, oh, that blue looks cute. But it's blue, but you can't really tell it's blue. I don't know what it is, but I want it. And so now I looked and I was like, okay, this is pretty long. It's probably going, you know, if it's human, it's probably going to cost arm and leg. Come to find out it wasn't human, but it looks, it reminds me of Brazilian curly, but that's just me. So the new girl, I'm going to pronounce this name all wrong. I'm not even going to attempt. No, I am. Beshi, I guess. I don't know how to pronounce it, but that's the name of the company. It's called Lady Lace Ear to Ear Lace Wig, and it's a Futura wig, which means it's synthetic, but it's curl and iron safe up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and it has two inches of a deep lace, which we'll see when I when we do when I show you guys the specs and show you the construction of the wig. So it came in this nice bag and the color of it is F1B and blue and it says frost so the actual color how I said it's black and blue mix it's 1B mixed with blue so you can't you can see the blue but you can't see the blue almost looks like a frost of blue I love it not necessarily a blue black but blue so now the lace that it has, it is the French lace. So this is what I cut off in the front. So, and that's what it looks like to my skin. So now, I didn't put this on how I would normally put it on so it's not pinned in at the moment. But I did pull out a little bit of my hair in the front. Just a little bit. And as you can see... Because the 1B color, it actually doesn't look crazy. But I love this wig, okay? Love it. So, as I said, it's really long. So, sorry, just a few strands. And by this one being synthetic I'm not too mad at the shedding because it didn't really cost me that much in the first place I really just want to try for the color because I just wanted to try a new color and blue I've never done blue hair so this was this is definitely about a 28 to 30 inch of hair and it has this nice curl pattern which I said reminds me of a Brazilian curly and that's the texture that it gives off too so Hey, so I just want to give you guys the specs and show you the construction of the wig. So, this is a lace front. So now, I don't know if you guys know the difference between a lace front wig and a full lace wig, of course. A full lace wig being that the whole entire wig is lace. A lace front being that it is only lace in the front. Now, this lace is the harder lace, which is French lace. It's more like a plastic kind of. It's a little bit more durable than Swiss but a little bit harder to blend than Swiss. So you have about, I'll say, an inch and a half of parting space here in the front. There are three combs, two on the sides, and one in the back. Adjustable straps. And as you can see, it's tracks throughout the wig. So, let's put this back on. And for anybody who has a small head, this one actually fits really tight. Like, it's really good. So, I'm just putting it along my hairline, as you can see.
And so this is what it looks like without me putting any hair out. I don't know, tell me what you guys think. You like it, you love it, you hate it. I mean, I definitely was de the blue bandit walking around New York for a while. And I'm actually deciding if I would like to try this color out on some human hair. I think this would be pretty cool. It won't get the same effect. I think it would be pretty hard to do a 1B and a blue mix the way they have it. But it definitely would be an interesting thing to try. So I don't know, I might, I might, this might be, this might be the next signature look for me for a little bit. I don't know, so let me know what you think. Make sure you press the like button, you can subscribe to the channel, and comment. Thanks for watching. Peace.